Hello, everybody. This is your professor, Ian. Uh, I'm leaving you a short video um, guiding you through how to use Perusal. Perusal is a, called a, a social annotation program or application. Uh, and it's basically like a Google Doc or some kind of shared document that we all get to read together and leave comments on, engage in discussions. It's, uh, it's a great tool I love for online courses. So let me show you how to use it. Um, this isn't your course. This is one of my older courses. I'm just showing you how to use this application. So you'll want to click on modules. That's the main page I use in Canvas. And let's see, let's scroll down to the syllabus review. You're going to have an assignment <clears throat> that looks almost identical to this. There's instructions. Uh, there's the, a, a link to the very video you're watching right now. And if you scroll to the bottom, you'll see a little button here. Every time I have a perusal assignment, it'll have a little button, load discussion, um, in new window. So you don't have to go to Perusal the program to use Perusal. You just click here and it takes you automatically to the Perusal site with the documents that I've loaded. Um, and here we are. Here is the here is a, a syllabus from a previous course. Um, and you'll use Perusal to mark this up for the first for this first week. We're just getting to know Perusal. So um, you know, the, the goal here is just to engage with the syllabus and use the program, get used to it, engage with each other. So it, it's a really easy program to use. Let's say I want to leave a comment here, right? Okay, you highlight text in the PDF, and then it'll take you to this menu here. You can do a lot of things. You can play with your text. Uh, you can leave links. You can insert images. So if you want to leave a funny meme for everybody, sometimes I'll leave uh, pictures or videos of um, things if there's a discussion. Right, so you can do things like that, insert video, emojis, all kinds of stuff. Mostly you're just going to want to leave text like, uh, uh, let's see, I have a question. Why just short fiction? This is from a short fiction course that I taught in the summer. Why just short fiction? Right, press enter. And look at that, I've left a, a, a question. Um, right, and every, when you leave a comment, you end with a question mark, it'll um, tag it as a question. And you can leave it that way, and that way people can answer you and engage with it in that way. You don't have to leave a question. You can say, you know, I love this title. You don't have to leave a question. See the difference? Uh, anyway, so let's go back to the, the main text. If you click on it, it'll take you there. And then let's, let's close this conversation menu. So now if I scroll down, um, so you can see people having discussions, you'll see highlighted text if you go through, right? So let's click on one of that. You can see the kind of um, conversation that people are having. Let me just move myself a little bit, right? Here's a student asking a question about this, this comment. Here's another question engaging. Oh, good question, right? And see how they're engaging with each other. And then I come in and I, I engage with them both, answer their questions. So this is the kind of, these are the kind of comments you want to leave, right? Don't just, you know, what two words that's cool, or I agree because you're cool, or something like that, right? Try to engage with each other. This is our, uh, this is the, the main platform we'll be using this semester to discuss the weekly texts. Um, so it's important to engage with each other in a deeper, a, a deeper manner. Um, okay, so that's perusal. It's pretty straightforward. The first week is just all about playing with it. So please do try some different things, get used to it. We're going to be using it almost every week. Okay, thank you. Uh, and if you're having technical difficulties with perusal, please get a hold of me as soon as you can, because again, we will be using this a lot. So it's important for us to, um, you know, get you up to speed on this, this app. But trust me, it's super straightforward. I've had uh, uh, many, mo most of my students absolutely love this uh, platform. So please do email me if you have any questions or concerns.